Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is Kitanovich, and I'd like to welcome you all back to another episode of Let's Play on The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. So last time, we just took on the Divine Beast Valredania, or Rudania, whatever you want to call. And yeah, it guys shows Druk's protection. Like, if I hold ZR, it show pops up, it shows us the Druk's protection, which is really cool about. So yeah, now we're going to go continue on and and do some side quest. Because today for the side quest, uh, there's there's gonna be some shrines I'm gonna go down. And the shrine quest, what I'm gonna go for is this one right here. Like, you see the angry Goron here? Where did he go? And that's where we're gonna go talk to him, so. My reckless brother hasn't come back yet. What in the world is he thinking? Uh, brother? My little brother, Gon Goron. I'm really proud of him, but he said he was gonna go dig up the secret of the hero, and then he just took off. I really don't know what in the world got into him. Where did he go? I'm certain my little brother went off to Gorko Tano, southwest of Gorko Lake. The bedrock in that tunnel is incredibly hard, so as Gorons gave up trying to dig it out ages ago. Instead of chasing dreams, I'd prefer to see him face reality and help us out with our important Goron work. So there we go, Brothers Roast. So this is what we're going to be doing in this episode. So yeah, we're going to be doing a lot of the major side quest stuff. And uh, yeah, so we're going to go ahead and uh, start heading up here. Like we're going to, like, I believe we're supposed to be, uh, going up because I believe this is where the game uh, guy told me about like have to just go up all right let's go and you know since I haven't since I totally have enough stamina I can go uh, the part where I was about to be heading to the, the the other shrine I believe So hopefully, uh, what is it? Uh, hopefully, I don't get lost too much. Okay, nope. Sorry, I hit the wrong button. I did not mean to hit the wrong button. Uh, I meant to go the go over there. So I've been scanning amiibos and. The one thing I want to show you guys off is uh, is this this one, Sword of the Six Sages. So it's for Twilight Princess, and what I did is I scanned the Twilight Princess Smash Bros. Ganondorf amiibo, and yeah, it gives me uh, that. It just gives me like uh, Sword of Six Sages. So since I got that, uh, perfect timing. But I'm gonna wait until I get the full armor of Twilight Princess Link, which I still have to do. But anyways, as you guys can see, there's a Goron just lying there. It looks like he's tired out, so we're gonna go ahead and talk to it. So, <laughs> whew, whew, I'm spent. To think that somewhere behind all this rubble is the secret of the hero. I know I'll become really great and important if I can find it. My only problem is that I don't have the strength to go on. My belly is empty and rumbling like mad. What to do? Brother, so this is where you've been. I tried to think like my brother and do what he would do so I could find him. I need you to do me a favor as as a brother. I can't just sit and idly by. I have to help him. Exit here and head down the hill to Gortram Cliff. There you can find rock roosts rolling around. I need you to grab one of them for me. I'd like more than anything to go there and get it myself. It's just, well... I have a chronic condition, yeah, it's called Goron Shoulder, very serious, I'd rather not talk about it. Needless to say, I expect a lot from you, please do me, please don't let me down, so. Don't you worry, I won't let you down. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put Majora's Mask on, so, because I believe, like, I have a feeling we're, yeah, not the Choochers, but there's a Moblin here. Those enemies. That we're gonna have to be careful about. And 
Same goes with the boulders here. So here it is. And as you guys can tell, this looks just like from Majora's Mask. Like, if you guys played Majora's Mask, you will know what it looks like. Like, you just have to, like, break it from the light lamp from the ceiling. And then, uh, you just have to, uh, you know, you just have to, uh, you know, get that so you can defeat the Goron. And you can get yourselves a Dongiro's Mask. So, uh, it's up on my channel, uh, if you guys want to check it out, um, okay. The, so, the part when I was 18 years old. I wish I could say 16, but when I look back from my older videos, I'm not happy with the Let's Play, so... I already redone that game before. And, yeah, I already felt grateful about that. Alright, are they gonna attack me? Okay. Well, the choo-choo's are. Whoa, okay, they almost got me. Oh my gosh, okay, get over there. Ooh, oh my gosh, wait, I can't see, okay. I can't see with the camera angle. Oh Alright, so we're almost there. Alrighty, the Moblin's still chasing me. So I'll be safe if I put if I put my caps on for Link style. Alrighty, so finally I've been waiting on you. Go on, drop the roast in the pot quickly. Hmm, it's amazing. This is the finest rock roast they've ever laid eyes on. I'm gonna cook it up right away. <laughs> I, I did it! I made a deliciously grilled rock roast! Hmm? Am I a hunger hello new Katie? Or do I really smell deliciously grilled rock roast? Brother, it's ready! You're gonna eat it and love it and everything will be as should be again. Look at this! It looks so tasty! I need to eat it right away! Yummy, delicious, incredible. That texture, that crunch, oh, and the gritty feeling as it glides down my throat. Oh, yes, can't forget that savory flavor of Kunda's mind rolls seared at high heat to perfection. It's a taste explosion. It's restoring my strength. And I'm like Phoenix, reborn and ready to fly. In fact, I am Death Mountain. Your cooking is the best of the best, brother. Now I'm full and my belly's happy. Let's do this! <laughs> go on, power, go! <laughs> wow! There it is! The hero's secret has revealed itself to me. Weird. I feel like I've seen something like this before in Goron so City. So this is the secret of the path, eh? Hmm, it looks oddly familiar. Anyway, what an amazing discovery. That's my brother for ya. So there you go. It's complete. Alrighty, before I do anything... Alright, I'm trying to see what food I got with me. It looks like I don't, but... Oh, well. Okay, I thought I do, but... But, you know, that's... I don't know. <laughs> let's let's get into the shrine. So here we are in... Uh, Greedy Hill. So, it, it's, it's gonna be annoying, but it should not be too annoyed. The funny story from this... The right... Or not... Right, the left side! Oh my god, it just it almost crushed me. They served out rupees. Alrighty, this one I want to get. Okay, so close on this. Oh gosh, dang it. No, Link, get up! 
Oh, okay. That's the part where it gets pretty annoying, if you ask if you ask me. Okay, yeah, they didn't drop... Oh, wait, there is red rupees. What am I talking about? Okay. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, oh, hey, at least it didn't knock me down. <laughs> that is some huge hills. Alrighty. Let me glide down here. Oh, that was close. Five bomb arrows. Okay. So there we go. I think we can move on to the other shrines. Oh yes. Um, depart from the Robbies. That's close to it. Since I got enough enough stamina here. Cool. Alrighty, so, uh, I am here at the, uh, Akka Ancient Tech Lab, so the reason why I'm doing- I'm back here is because we're gonna be, uh, heading to that shrine, which I'm just about to be heading down there. Alrighty, so hopefully I have enough stamina to go down- so the reason why I need more stamina is because the- this is why the wind- it's trying to get us screwed up, and slow us down. So I'm hoping I can, I can make it there. Oh my gosh, please. Please, can I make it here? I want to make it here. So yes, the shrine is nearby. Okay, I have to be on the ground though. So I'll start. So I made it. Yes. You who have reached this point, proceed on war through the mass, and you will receive a reward. Alrighty. So trial. Uh. Okay. I didn't read what it says. Trial of the late. Wait, what the- Oh, you freaking guardian, you wanna go? Okay. That's not what I'm trying to do, but... What? I thought I hit the A button. You know, I'll just let it- I'll just use one more boost protection. That's karma for you. But don't worry, it'll get replenished. Alright, at least a good thing I didn't die. So yeah, if you try to go here, it says activate again in 17 like minutes. Oh my gosh, that's I know it's a lot, but but okay. What the what the heck was that? I'm trying to go up. There is a guardian of Skywatcher I'm gonna have to be careful about. Good thing I still have more enough stamina to take care of this. Hey, at least I'm glad we we didn't see um the uh you know the um the volcano erupted. It won't we won't see it erupted if we activate uh Valrudania uh back together. Alright, I hope I am okay, I'm hoping I have enough stamina, you know. I, since I have enough like like I got these kind and I can use it whatever I want. Okay, so I'm I'm almost there. Okay. Almost there, guys. I can do it. <laughs> Woo! Oh, oh my gosh. I did it. I like how we just can see Link's, uh, you know, I don't know. 
no idea what I'm talking about. Oh, snap! See here, I knew it because this stupid Skywatcher is going to screw me up like that. Oh, oh, you have got to be kidding me. <sighs> I hate when it does that for the rain. Alrighty, whoa! Oh, yes, there he is. That's what I wanted to do. And I'm just gonna climb on a ladder. I don't want to lose and waste my stamina if I'm climbing. Okay, can't go that way. Alright, bats. I'll just hit the bats with the with a master sword. Uh, because, you know, I just want to, like, get my Master Sword to re-replenish since I've been using it against two of the battles. Alrighty, so, let me go ahead and take, whoops, uh, take off the stamp. There we go, delete it. So there we go. Now let's head right in here. Alrighty, so this is... Just the chest. Oh, uh, we can go ahead and uh, just open up, see what we can get. Barbarian helm. So that's a new armor we got with us. Pretty cool. Alrighty. So yeah, don't worry, um, if the Master Sword, um, it won't break, it just gets out, runs out of energy if you keep using it to fight it, fight the enemies. You just have to wait till it's replenished. Like, wait until it gets recharged. That's what I only want to know. Okay, so I have to make a cut. I uh, just want to start off here, because I'm gonna have to, uh, because there's, because I want to go to the huge tree. Okay, come on. Get out of here. Woo. Still gonna keep using Master Sword until it's out of charge. So that way... Uh, ow? Okay. I tried to backflip. Hey, at least it didn't burn my Halion Shield. Because it's made of metal, which I'm very grateful about. Because if it's not made of metal, that would be more, uh, upsetting. <laughs> okay, I like when I have black backflip and I just, and I just get hurt either way. I'm just saying what's well, pretty funny to me. I'll just put the pin here, so you guys will know what I'm talking about, because because that's the direction I'm trying to go there. Ouch. Okay, that giant, that Octorok, uh, just killed my choo my collection for the choo choos. Gotcha. Alright. So it's all the way there. I know it's, it's weird that when I say it, it's at the tree, but it's not really at the tree. It's like in the shadow. But yeah, it is pretty weird. Uh, I can go ahead and set back to my to this one. But yeah, we only have 
two more divine beasts left. After two more, then uh, we will, um, you know, after two more, uh, we will be uh, okay to, you know, we don't have to worry about them, and we can just, uh, you know, move on to, for some more shrines and more of a Koroks. Uh, also more of a divine. Well, I'm sorry, no. Then also we'll do the all the trials, swords of a trial, and and then uh, so much more stuff. Like I heard on September 26th, there's gonna be a new update on this game. I think because we're gonna have a because Nintendo announced uh, Hyrule Warriors: Age of Calamity uh, from um, September 8th, and uh, we are just about to be getting into that. And you know that is what I'm really excited for because it because it tells me that there's a prequel before how how did a hundred years ago um, starts from this game. Oh wait. Traveler, for beyond these woods, you are now faced with a trial. Find the shrine hidden in the trial. I just killed myself. Because of the scene that killed me. Wow. How dare they? Do I have to do this again? Okay, no. <laughs> I I can't see what I'm doing. All I do is just fall into the lava. Okay. I just slow down. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Jeez. Oh, gosh. I can't see. I can't see where I'm going. Oh, great. Well, I might need it. <laughs> I like how it just goes like that. Wait, what? Okay, I could have sworn if I hear like it, the theme, we're gonna have to deal with Hanox. I could have sworn about that. This is the one. Okay, I was gonna say, where is his hand? Okay. Okay, just get on his hand. Okay, I'm just gonna wait patiently. Until he throws me up to the tummy. Okay. Wait, if I throw... Oh, wait, where is it? Oh, right there. Yep. Okay, I, I, I saw I woke it up. Wait. I don't know. Did I seriously wake it up? I don't know if I did. I'm gonna have to listen to music if I hear it, cause, you know, my headset are not really that on because, you know, my headset are pretty, pretty big for my ears. <laughs> Which, that's pretty much a huge bummer if you ask me. I'm sorry you hear me typing. Okay. Okay, we're just gonna tip. We're just gonna. 
Okay. No. <laughs> I can see his toes here. Oh, hey, I can see Link's uh, eye is dark. Oops. I don't know. Is he really awake? I don't know. <laughs> okay, let's not let's not pick on him right now. Let's just get into the shrine and so we can move on. Okay, okay, let's see what we got here. Alright, now we're beginning another spirit orb. We can have a chance to get some more. Ancient core, not bad. I'll take it, why not? So yeah, I'll be I'll be sure to go ahead and um you know just explore for other shrines because there's a lot of stuff we're gonna take care of. Like this game is really huge. Oh look at that, we got four spirit orbs. Okay, guys. So what I did, um, since after I took care of a shrine, I choose to go back to Hantano Village. So I, since I got four spear orbs, now I got kind of a full stamina, which pretty cool about it, cause now I can focus on either getting more heart containers or get more of a of a stamina vessel. So yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, have some fun with this. Oh, like take out the guardian. Wait, what the? Ah, oh, dang it, wait. Oh my gosh, what the flip just happened? Okay, weird. No, you broke my other shield. How dare you? I, tr I try to hit the A button. There we go, jeez. Don't know what's going on. Hey, <laughs> hey, I just... Wait, what the... What is going on? Game... What the flip? I I hit the A button and it didn't come out. Okay, seriously, I hit the freaking A button. Would you give me my... Thank you. My gosh, I hate this thing so much. Bro, make me waste my shield. Okay, you're the responsible for this. Yeah, let's see how you like it, jerk. <sighs> I hate those things. Alright, so I'll just be, uh... I don't know. I was just looking around. Okay, why are you rolling on the floor, Link? <laughs> he just likes to roll on the ground after the shield broke. Oh, great. Not so great at all. Oh, there we go. That's why I want to come there. And yes, it's thunderstorm. Oh, hey, I found a Korok on my first try on the without looking up game guide for this part. All right, bye bye. Wow, this must be my lucky day here. Not sure if we're getting close to the. Oh, okay, nope. Not going to electrocute me. Oh no, 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 
Come on. Okay, wait. What the? I hit the X button. I hit the X button for like a second. Jeez. Oh, here it is. It's this one. <gasps> oh, god dang it. Alrighty, well. Oh, gosh. Seriously? Do I have to cut that out? That's going to be forever for me. Or maybe... Maybe it won't be forever because... We got the dime... Diamondite. I hope I said it right. Because what... Because I'm thinking, what if the dynamites can help us... Uh... Get to that. Darn it, stupid ring. Alright, I wonder if I can... What if I can, um... Uh, what if I go up to the hill? <sighs> Darn it. Oh, and... You know what? I guess there there is a Korok. I guess I'll go ahead and focus on the Koroks. All right, so it leads to the to the street. Oh, I don't think I can get that far enough. Okay. Okay, hopefully, hopefully I am fast enough for this. I have to be fast enough for that. The Rook's protection is now ready to roll. Sweet, the Rook's protection is ready to roll. Ha! There we go. I made it. Yeah. All right, I'll take the Korok seed. I got thirteen. Alrighty, here is the. Rush room. We'll get to like. Alright, how many do we have? 19! Okay, so we need to get to 55 for that. Okay. I guess I'll just be going up, see if there's anything I want to. Oh, n another rush room I can take. Yeah, since while we wait until the rain is stopped, because I want to go ahead and, uh, just grab myself, um, just want to grab myself another, like, shrine. You know, because we have rain right now, and we can't get rain to stop. Okay. Now, okay. Oh, what the? How is it? Oh my gosh, really? Okay. All right, I'm going back down there. Okay, is this... I think this is the part. Alrighty, well... 
time for me to make a cut. So I will see you guys once it stops raining. Alrighty, it's finally now the sunniest day. Thank goodness it's now there. <sighs> Alright, now what I can do is shoot the bomb arrows to blow up the hole. And it is going to be fire, but that's the only option we can use. Okay, I don't know why the... Whoa! Okay, for some reason, I don't know why this game looks so laggy to me during a flat fire. <clears throat> Excuse me. Like, it's so weird. Like, I don't know why. It's just... When it, when it lags like that, it feels pretty, pretty weird. Okay, good thing I have another... I got another one of this. Or another one of this. Eh. Can't speak. Alrighty, let's head into the shrine. Alrighty, so this is a minor test of strength. Okay. So yeah, I'm gonna have to use the Master Sword for this. I have to do this because I want to get it recharged. Uh, so that way, if I'm heading to like uh, the boss, like I heard it said about the Rito and the Gerudo. So if I go anywhere like that, I'm gonna be sure uh, I get my stuff recharged if I want to become a Link style, just like that. So I'm sorry, Master Sword. I love you, but I promise you'll be recharged. That was awesome. It does do a really good job taking the enemies out. I'll be sure to visit uh, the Robbie's uh, An Akikala Ancient Lab. Uh, see how much Ancient Sword costs. So, I might have to wait for that because I don't have enough weapon stash and I don't think I have enough Korok seeds. Uh, to do those kind of stuff. But okay, so... Uh, yeah. We're gonna do that, and there is the other shrine we're gonna be um, going. That'll be on the bridge. So that is where we're gonna be doing that uh, right now this episode. So yeah. Alrighty. So let's go. Okay, let's see, is there... Oh, yes! Okay, don't... You know what? I'm taking the rush room. Don't want to forget this. Oh! You know what? Don't... I can't forget about the Korok, either. Because I see a rock like that, which it tells me there is a Korok. So, yeah. Hopefully, if I got the all maps full... Uh, now I can start exploring any huge maps, so I can start exploring for, for some more... Uh, just explore some more of uh, uh, the Koroks, because I want to get to 900 Koroks for 100%ing this game. Like, I'm 100%ing like I'm 100 it for getting all 120 shrines and collect 900, 900 Korok seeds. Um, do all of the DLCs and all the side quests and so much more. All of this is what my 100% is all about. It is a big map, but that's, that's just the way it is. Alright, I'll go ahead and start putting the, my Majora's Mask on. Hey Korok, how's it going? One thing I don't understand is how the how can the Korok survive 
from, uh, what is it? How can they survive uh, from the hot lava, like, at the Death Mountain? It doesn't, it doesn't make any sense to me, in my opinion. Like, I just don't know how. That, it, it's just what I only really wanted to know about. Alrighty, so we're close to the shrine. Here it is! There is a shrine. Alright, I can go ahead and switch back. Let's head right in. So this is, uh, this is two orbs to guide you. So that means... Okay, there's a hole there. There we go. Just once. So that can open. Go ahead, toss it in here. All right, there you go. That way, it can we can make it move. I'm pretty grateful about this. All right. Yes, made it. So here we go, another shrine we found. I'll probably get like four more heart containers. And then it'll be stamina. I'm just thinking in my head for my ideas. Okay, so after I've been taking myself to, uh, pretty much long. So what I did, I make my way back to... Uh, what is it? Uh, I, I made my way back to, uh, the Robbie's uh, sh shop, so I could grab myself some Ancient Sword, which, which that is where I'm gonna be ke keeping for. So that, cause it's for the little boys and the Sword Quest. And that's where I'm gonna be doing, and right now what I'm doing is, I'm just wanna like, attack uh, the guardians here, so I can have myself some more ancient stuff, and you know, just want to make my master sword lose its charge because because it it can lose charge, but I want to wait until it's replenished. Wait, what was that? Okay, nothing. Oh, I saw something. So I do know where we can go. I know where the memory is, so it's not too bad to go down there. Alright, I'm gonna shoot you before you kill me. So there we go. At least the good thing, since we'll be exploring around while waiting till my Master Sword gets- Okay- <gasps> Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Did you guys see that? It's Fawarash. Dude. We can even, I think. Okay, I want to get the scale for, for something that's going to be important if, I, if I'm fast enough. But we are close to the tower, which good thing we can put the maps here. Alrighty, if I can make it, that would be great. But that is really awesome to see that. And I see a falling star uh, there. <laughs> oh, 
Alright, where are you? Wait. Is it going up? Oh no, it's coming closer, but... I'm sure there's a music coming, like, it's coming closer right now. Yes, there we go. No, wait, wait, what the? Why can I not shoot it? There we go. I'm trying to get the scale. That music is so awesome. Oh, hello, Korok. Nope. There you go. Found a Korok. Alright. Oh geez, I can't see where I'm going, maybe? Like, it's going all the way up to the sky. Oh, yeah, I'm just saying it looks so cool. Okay, there it goes running up energy. So there we go So that's why I want to do that so I can have my map so I can have my master sword replenish before I go to any other boss any uh, bosses challenge and We can have an, a good time So let's see here. So how many do we need so? Nine minutes. Okay, it should not take too. It won't take. T it should not take too long from the nine minutes. Okay, stay up here, Link. Okay, just stand right here. Yes, I made it. Okay, the sc scale, awesome. For warish scale, that is just where I need. Alrighty, so the memory I know about. It looks like this. So I have a feeling it's gotta be that tree. But before I go there, I'm gonna go to the tower first. So that way, uh, I've, uh that way after I do the tower, then I can start heading down here, and we can, uh, you know, we could just um, uh, uh, go do a cool different stuff like this. It was just my idea, and you know. Oh, okay, there's a, sh there's a shrine is nearby. Fishing hair pond. Or hair poon, I don't know. Like, harp, I don't know if I said a name right, but. Got it on a weapons um, material. Zora spear, which I'm not gonna get to. Oh, hi, wow. Wait, what? It was... Like, he was up up in on the sky, but... Okay. I think there's... Uh, what is it? Um, there's this... Uh, the Kor Korok somewhere up top, which I want to go take a look. 
So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, start hit heading up there. Okay. Alrighty. But all right, come. On. Okay, it's not there, so it has to be down. Alrighty. She now I got two things we're gonna do. Oh yes, I'll t I will take the lift. For wars, thank you. So the Sheikah Tower first, then the shrine, and then uh, we can go find another missing memory. So I'm glad I so I'm glad I figured myself out. So, Lake Tower. This is Lake Tower. Alrighty, drop down. Okay, we're almost there. Oh, there we go. Shrine. Definitely, I'm going down. So there we go. After this, then we're gonna uh, go down for the shrine, and then the missing memory, in a good way. So there we go. Now we know where we can, now we know where the map we can go. So we're just gonna fly there to the shrine, and after that, then uh, yes, we can go find the missing memory. So yeah, it did took me pretty you know it took me pretty much a bit of a long time to figure out where do I have to go next. Um, but now I do, so... So I'm just glad I know where I'm going. It's fun to explore around in this game. It does have a big, huge map. So here's the shrine. We're gonna go down. Alrighty, so here we go. So now what's this one? Shatter the heavens. All right. So here. Just like that. That was just some of my idea. Alright, here we go. Nope, I failed to get the chest. <laughs> oh well. Don't even care about that too much, but... But alrighty. Now the memory and then the other shrine. A lot of stuff we're gonna be taking care of because this game is, has a huge map. So that's where we're gonna be doing in this video. You know what? That's right. One thing I forgot to mention, the core rock is somewhere up on top of the bridge. I I checked um 
I checked on this one last time, so I'm gonna go... Wow, all the way there. <clears throat> Wasn't thinking that, but don't worry, we'll get to the memory um, soon after this. It's just, there's so much stuff we have to do. Like, all of the shrines, all the Koroks, all the stuff we're gonna take care of. Like, they're just everything. See any like for wall fall for warish or yeah. Don't see where they are right now. They sometimes come around like I don't know when, but but it just sometimes uh didn't pop up so much, or sometimes they do. Alright, I don't know what these rocks are supposed to do. Like... Like, is there supposed to be like a... Wait. Oh. So, let me... Th hold on. Oh jeez, this is gonna be a tough one here. I don't know if I'm gonna do this. <laughs> no, that didn't do anything. I think I have to go probably on on the bridge. Okay, well, since it, I see what this is, so I'll just go ahead and shoot it. Alrighty, so that gives us a Korok. Another Korok, so we got 17 more. Um, more we can upgrade. Wait, did I? How did I? I barely landed there, what the heck? Are you trying to troll me, game? Is that what you're doing to me right now? Okay. No! Oh my gosh, okay, why did I do that? I don't want to lose my rupees. I have no idea why it's raining like that, but... But maybe... What I... Oh, there's rocks there, which... Oh! Okay. Okay, hopefully I got this. Okay, that wasn't far... And, yep, no. Bye, bad. <laughs> okay, let's try again. Okay... Throw! Okay, this, this is... Nope, we're so close. Okay. Okay, come on, toss it! What? Okay, hold on. It shouldn't be... Oh gosh, why did I... That was stupid. That was stupid right here. Okay, I'm gonna have some hard time doing this. Okay, yes, there we go. Okay, I'm trying that's how I'm trying to do. Get into the center with by throwing the rock there. There we go. <laughs> I don't know what happened, but well, I do know what happened. Like I just don't know what's going on, but but I'm glad I figured it out. Is that gonna be another Korok down here? I don't know. Oh yes, my Master Sword's power has been restored. Well, 
since I got the Zora um, armor set with me, which I can swim up the waterfall. I'm going to grab some rush room. Oh, I got they call it rush room, which reminds me like restroom, which is pretty appropriate word to say. <laughs> I don't know why, but okay. Wait, is this it? Oh no, that's just a chest, but okay. Okay. Got herself an ice arrow. Alright, there he goes. Swim upward. Okay, I need to find out it looks like a square on it. Wait, oh. I think it's this one. It's been like mixed up. No, don't. Oh my gosh, what the heck? No. Okay, get up there. Alright, I'll just wait to get it up. Okay. It, it's just gonna keep falling into the water, but it should not be big of a deal if I don't lose it. There we go. Oh, wait. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Are you serious right now? I should have known. When were you gonna tell me about that? I... <laughs> okay, why are you... Okay, you better not be lost. Like, I will seriously be so mad. Okay, no. I don't know how far... No, Link, do not go in underwater. Okay. Okay, go. Wait. Did you- Oh gosh dang it, I got this <laughs> Did you guys see- How can the goat die like that from the box? Well, not it's not really a box, but how can they die from the block? <laughs> oh my gosh, wow, I- I never knew it does that. <laughs> oh, that was- I don't know. <laughs> okay. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna put you here. So that way I oh, so that way I don't accidentally like lose you. And I don't want it to lose. No. Alright, drop this. Is it far enough to... No. Okay, you know what? No, I have a feeling it's not far enough for me. I'm gonna have to put another one. Wait, that's the stasis? I meant to go to Magnus's? Okay, it's raining right now, but it should not be big of a deal. Yeah, am I supposed to, like, put it here? <gasps> oh, wait! I got it! Whoa, what? Oh! <laughs> okay, I I got it. Alright. 
After I've been doing this, okay, so I'm gonna have to. Yeah, I, I did have to cut that. Oh my gosh, can I make it? No, come on, come on! I got the Zora power. I got the Zora suit up. I can do it. Yes. Thank you. No, 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 no. Go, go, come. On. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. We're <sighs> okay. All right, my my master sword is now restored. Now. That means I can have my own Link style again. Well, technically not really Link style when it looks like this, but... But, either way, uh, that, that's, that's the way I wanted to do. And wanted to make it look like. Alrighty, but no more wasting time this time. There's a lot of times I'm gonna keep on seeing. Alrighty. Here it is, the memory. Okay, so I think... Okay, is there... Oh, okay. I was gonna say, is there any quark here? But there is a quark behind it. Okay. Now, let's go ahead and uh, recall the memory. See what it looks like. Anytime soon. Your path seems to mirror your father's. You've dedicated yourself to becoming a knight as well. Your commitment to the training necessary to fulfill your goal is really quite admirable. I see now why you would be the chosen one. What if one day you realized? That you just weren't meant to be a fighter. Yet the only thing people ever said was that you were born into a family of the royal guard, and so no matter what you thought, you had to become a knight. If that was the only thing you were ever told. I wonder then, would you have chosen a different path? Okay, so that's the memory. So this is the only memory we got. Alrighty, uh... Oh yeah, I can, um... Uh, start making my way here because... Uh, we just... Because we just, uh, got ourselves a... What is it? Oh, we just, uh, got a shrine we're gonna be heading down there. Alrighty, so I'm ba back, and is it? So it's during raining, and... Okay, yeah, just raining. <laughs> okay, I thought we are gonna have a thunderstorm, be like, are you serious right now? So, <laughs> but, no. Oh, okay, it's cloud right now, so... So yeah, we're gonna be heading to that shrine, and after that, then, uh... Oh, then... We will just make our way here, because I just place, um, the stamp here. Which means that takes me to a shrine. But there's also going to be another Divine Beast stage uh, we're going to be doing. So I'm going to enjoy playing this game for like, a, for like another two hours. And you stupid Lizifos. Okay, you guys are more annoying. I just want to be what I want to be. Just because I don't have a Majora's Mask on me, and just because you want to attack me, doesn't mean you have to, like, be a bully me. Like, I just got some business to take care of, so I don't want any of this problem. Alrighty, so I see you. Oh, come on now. Alrighty, you wanna go? Let's see what I got. Boom! 
Hikari. Okay, I don't really need that, but thanks. Wait, who just attacked? Well, I'll get rid of it when we get to that. Yeah, when we get to the, the stable lab. Or I'm not lab, not lab, the stable. Okay. Ooh, you know what? I'll, I'll take a picture of a white goat. Hi! Just want to take a picture. That's okay with you. Nope, wrong button. Sorry. Oh yeah, I took a picture of that because I wanted to remember uh, what do I do with the core rock. Okay, so... I'll just take a picture of that and I'll be sure to take the rest of the pictures. Like, I'll just, like, drop this. Nope. No, what am I doing? No. Okay, I meant... No. Oh my gosh. What is going on with me right now? Okay, let's do a shield. And then I'll do a sword. There we go. Oh, wait a minute. You know what? Uh, I got the Lino's bow. I don't want to forget about taking a picture. There we go. I'm just collecting more of these as I can. Some of them might be hard, but... But it should, should not be too much. But okay. Um, board opponent, please. Uh, I'm good, but thank you. That's all I want for now. Alright, let's go ahead to the, the shrine where it's recommending us to go there. And after that, they will obviously um, heading to, I believe, a next Divine Beast stage we're going to be taking care of. It might be another two hours, but it's going to be, we're going to have fun with that. And I'm sure we're going to have fun with that as well for you guys. Okay, so is this a battle or? No, okay. So the metal door. All right, I'm gonna have to prepare for some, um, some guardian. All right, like this this one right here. Oh, hey, you can't. What do you What do you think you're going? Okay. Oh, oh, now I'm gonna have to shoot you. Nope, you already shot me, so I'm gonna have to get you back for revenge. So that's karma for you. Okay, let's see what we get. I think... Is there gonna be big rupees or something? Nope, just a soldier's bow, but... You know what? I'll I'll take it. I was gonna say keep it, but take it. Blah, blah, blah. Either way. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. But alrighty, so this one, we're gonna have to... Okay, I don't want to get crushed. Alright, how about I turn around just like... Okay, so close. Oh, hi. Uh, I'll fight you in just, just a second. If you if you don't mind me, I'll just... Okay. Okay. You, you almost got me, but now it's time to do this. So... Headshot and... Headshot! Alright, can't take another one. I wonder what weapons I don't need. Okay, I have to keep this and that. Uh, okay, I was gonna say, do I have a frost spear? But I do have it. It's at, um, it's at Hantano Village. I keep it there for the little boy. But I have to find a duplex bow. Uh, he says he wants us to see the duplex bow. I won't be getting that chest, but, in the, but but at least I'll just do my best to complete all the shrines, as I've been saying every time in the game. 
So here you go. So now we got, how many spirit orbs do we have? Oh, we got four now. Okay, we got four. Okay, guys, so I come back here because, you know, when I come there, I want to do the Shika Tower here. Is that another? Oh, yes, another shrine. I'll be doing that soon. Alright, I think this is going to be like a... Hopefully a Korok. Okay, yes. I see the the glowing um, a, a spinner wheel because it tells me there is a... Sh well, I'm not trying. Uh, the Korok. Alright. Well, I didn't expect it can go so quickly. Alright. Oh, there's more. Ah! Okay, that was close. Okay. There we go. Got it. My gosh, I was not expecting it can go really quick. Whoa! Okay, oh, not at you again. Oh, hey, look at that! We can see the denril of dragging, like, flowing, flying there. That's so cool! I like how we could get to see those kind of stuff. That's so awesome. Alrighty. Oh, 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 yes, yes. That's what I was looking for. Okay, is there a fairy here? I don't want to scare the fairy away. Okay, it looks like there's no fairy. But I will get Mighty's Thistle. But yes, guys, this is our chance. Like, we can sp Well, oh, I don't I don't think I have enough. Well, I do have some stuff I can spend, um, one of my... I can sell some stuff collections for the root to get some more rupees. Okay, here it is. Boom! Alright. Oh, there's another one. Oh, break. So, boy, sweet boy, please listen to my story. Okay, so I am the great fairy Kesa. This place was once a beautiful spring, but as time passed, fewer and fewer travelers arrived to offer me rupees. As a result, my people has abandoned me. I'm nearly powerless now, so I beg your help. I need rupees to become whole again. All I need is 1,000 rupees. Once my power has been restored, I can help you do great things, boy. Now, if you have rupees, hand them over to me quickly. In order for me to regain my power, I need 1,000 rupees. Oh, jeez. Well, hopefully I can have enough if I sell any kind of stuff. Thank you. You are too kind. So the power is overflowing. So you're the one who brought me back from the brink. Oh my, I see how that my first impression of you was correct. You most definitely are pleasant to look at. How would you like to live here with me, hmm? <laughs> ha, I'm kidding, of course, but you certainly are cute when you're blushing. I, I really can't thank you enough, boy, but that won't stop me from trying. If you have the materials needed to enhance a piece of clothing, I will enhance your clothes. So why don't you let me take a peek in the little pouch of yours? Mm -hmm. With the power available to me, I can greatly enhance your clothing. Enhance away! 
Alrighty, so... Alrighty. Don't have enough blue night blue shade. All right, I'll go ahead and upgrade the, this one. So yeah, I have to skip it because I've seen it before. So there you go, you should be able to feel the care. I put into this. Oh, I just remembered. There are some items in the world that had when twice enhanced and worn as a set can give you a nice set bonus. Alright, another enhance, please. Okay, so... Can't do that one, or it is, but... But... I'll enhance this one. I do have a, like, uh, you know, I've been scanning amiibos and got myself some a uh, star, f like, I think it's a star? Mm. Alright, so, I'll just be, like, enhancing more clothes as I can. I'll do the, let's see. Um, I'll do, um, Twilight Princess, like, Cap of Twilight, because I've been wearing, because I just start wearing, a that cap, and I love, I like Twilight Princess, in my opinion, and, and, you know, um, um, Zelda Twilight Princess is Zelda Master's favorite game of all time. Alrighty, what other clothes I can hear? Alright, uh, I guess I'll enhance, um... Alright, so if I... <laughs> I was thinking about doing the Zora Helm, but I was thinking about doing the Barberin. Alrighty. Oh yeah, so... Here's something I want to show you, and it's gonna be... Uh, I think it should not be too weird, but here's what happens. She just, uh, kissed her finger and put it on us, so now we got two stars, so... Uh, I don't have it, but I'll see you later. So there we go. A gift for the Grey Fairy. So I did spend rupees, but don't worry, but I can still sell them, uh, from, uh, you know, from any places I can spend. So there might be... Okay, yes. We got some danger. We have danger right there. Alright, close enough with the rupees, but not so much. Alrighty, yep. You asked for this! Nope, you're not going to get me. Alright, so we're pretty much getting close to a top. Oh, look at that, there's Divine Beast. Val Meadow over there. Okay, is there? Oh, there is an eye. I was, I was hoping there might be an eye there. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna place my other pin over there. Alright, I'll delete this stamp here. 
Yeah, sure. I'll do that. Good thing I have Mifa's grace with me. If I, in case if I do get hurt. But I don't. But I'm, I'm not gonna. You know. I might use. Oh my gosh! What? Why did you do that, Link? He literally just like jumps off, and he never gets on to the like this thing here. Like he didn't. He just barely like make himself like jump off. What the heck was that, Link? That was weird when you do that. Alright, it's gonna be cold, but I'll just... But there we go, another Sheikah Tower activated. Okay, well, I'm gonna go ahead and um, eat something. Or... Or actually, you know what? Uh, is this where I came from? I'm gonna check. Alrighty, so I'm back. So, I have to go down here. Because uh, we just we just took care of the great fairy uh, gift, and uh, since I got the Goron spice with me, which I believe that's gonna be something we're gonna be using for. All right, all right, at least more spicy pepper. All right, I do want to take that one. Okay, I don't know what I can get rid of, so... I guess I'll get rid of the... Oh, there it is. Okay. Hey, you! Uh, I saw the Great Fairy. Oh. So, hey, it's you. Did you give the Great Fairy an offering? Of course I did! <laughs> Alright, thank you. Look, looks like asking you was a good call after all. So that means you met the Great Fairy, huh? Man, I'm so jealous. <laughs> but hey, at least you got to meet her, and that means, technically... I got to make my offering to the Great Fairy. I can't thank you enough. Forgetting something? Huh? Huh? Uh, no, I don't think so. Wait, what? You aren't trying to tell me you want a reward, are you? You got to see the Great Fairy thanks to my tip, didn't you? And now you're asking for more? Ah, uh, Great Fairy, even if it's just in my dreams, won't you appear before me? Eh, he did, he's not giving us anything, but... Oh well, at least we completed that. So, yeah, that's that's what all we wanted to. And uh, oh my gosh, dogs are barking. If you guys can tell for some reason, <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. If you guys hear docking, like the dog barking, it wasn't okay. It's not um the name. Well, it's not my dog this time. It was the, you know, it was my neighbor. If you guys can hear it right now. Like, right now you can hear it, which pretty much annoying in my opinion. But okay, do I have a hearty of foods I can use? Alright. Alright, I'm gonna go in near Cedars. Okay, do you have any? Alright, I wanna see if there's like... Okay, no. If I have a hearty food stuff, it'll be great. Okay. Good thing I have three fairies with me. Do I have a... Okay. I don't have like a... A raw gourmet meat. I wish I do, but... Alright, here we go. 
trying to toss it. Okay, I Wait. Oh, I do have a food with me. Here, I'll, I'll take... I can go ahead and take this one. We'll just have like a... You know, just eat half an apple. Okay. Alright. No more wasting time, guys. Let's... Alright, let's go. We're... Everyone's waiting for us, so we better get there right away. Alrighty. Hello, Valbetto. I see you up there. Alright, which one has less than a minute? So this one's 10... Alright, you know what? This one has two, so I'll just eat that one. Alright, I'm just gonna glide all the way down here. So, I do know, like, I know I got the four spear ores with me right now. But, and, uh, you know, I've been thinking to myself, like, if I got into, like, four heart containers, like, because I want to try to get to 30 heart containers as I can, but I'll be sure to upgrade more stamina as I can. Or maybe I should do three. Okay, so we're pretty much getting closer to the stable here. Alright, just gonna have to like slide here. Alright, my Lionel's shield is badly damaged, but it doesn't even matter because I got a other shield with me. Yeah, that does look pretty hurt, uh, to be honest. Okay, cool. Another spicy pepper I can make. Alright, I'm just gonna ignore the stupid Octorock. Alright, Rito's Stable. Alright, it's it's badly damaged, but... Oh, but, you know, hopefully if I scan another amiibo, like, probably day after tomorrow, or tomorrow or something... Uh, I can see what other weapons I can have. But anyway, the thing about me is, I just can't get enough spice in my life. Spicy! I need that burning tingle. I need curia rice. Now I have a Halion rice on hand, which I need to make curry rice, but I'm fresh out of Guan spice. I just, I can't just run off and leave the stable. If you happen to get your hands on some Guan spice, can you give it to me? Sure thing. Thank you kindly, sunny boy. Curry rice always warms me right up. Well, I got some with me, so that's Gorn Spice, alright. Hey, could I ask you to part that Gorn Spice for, say, 50 rupees? It's all yours. Thank you. With Gorn Spice and Halley Rice, I'll, I'll be able to make some curry rice to warm my soul. Here, your 50 rupees. And we got purple rupees worth 50. If you come across any more Gorn Spice, please bring it to me. Next time, I'll treat you some Hellion Rice for it. If you add another other ingredient to Guan Spice and Hellion Rice, you will make all kinds of different curry rice dishes. Try it next time when you have some spare ingredients. Alrighty, thank you for telling me that. So, you know what I've been thinking? You know, I should talk to the bird. I haven't talked to it yet. I was so focusing on, you know, doing my own business stuff, but... But, uh, okay, sorry if you hear Echo. <laughs> I was using my game guide. So this one, where he, he's playing some kind of like, I don't know what it's called, I can't say the name, but. So, greetings, traveler. How about a song? Th that there, on your hip. No, I'm sorry, it's nothing. I didn't mean to pray. Are you a bird? Have you never met a Rito before? 
Odd. My name is Cass. As a bard, I spend my days traveling this land in search of ancient songs. Have you heard of the ancient songs of Hyrule? Ancient songs? Ancient songs. Songs that sing the praises of a hero who beat back the calamity in an age past. One of the more famous among them recounts the events of 10,000 years ago. I happen to know a song about the ancient hero. It was passed down to me by my teacher. Do you care to hear it? Let's hear it. Excellent. Without further ado. The, the Kingdom of Hyru is a vast and storied land, oft grasped in the palm of a villainous land. A dark force of destruction, many times undone, rises once again, Ganon the Calamitas once. But hope survives in Hyrule, for all is not lost. Two brave souls protect it, no matter the cost. A goddess blood princess and a fearless knight, they, they appear in each age to fight the good fight. Their battle with Ganon, I have committed it to song to keep it through time, no matter how long. Now, begins the second verses. Listen, you'll know of their battle with Ganon 10,000 years ago. The, the Kingdom of Hyrule was once a land of lasting peace, a culture of strength, and with the suffering did seize. But Ganon worked beneath the surface, straightening its jaws. So the ancient people of Hyrule set out to help the cause. Their efforts bore fruit and an ultimated force to help avert calamity by sealing it at its source. Four giant behemoths for which power never ceased, each of these titans was called a divine beast and free-willed machines that hunted down their prey. These guardians were built to last so they could join the fry. To guide the beasts in battle, warriors were needed it so four champions pleaged to see Ganon defeated it. Divine beasts, guardians, princess, and knight, their plan to reach Ganon was looking alright. And, and when Calamity began to rear its head, Hyrule rose against it. The optimum of Hyrule all the more incensed it. Ganon raged in its insult, boiling with hate, its ganache, its teeth, and thrashed about. But it was all too late. The Guardians kept the force to save heroes through every hour. The Divine Beasts unleashed attacks that weakened Ganon's power. The, the hero with the Sealing Sword struck the final blow, and the holy power of the princess sealed Ganon's soul. And that is the story of a brazen attack on Calamity Ganon 10,000 years back. Thank you for listening. Please come back and hear it again sometime. Alright, anything else you want to say? Hmm? Uh, no, I don't want to hear it again. Huh. <laughs> I already hear it, but thanks. Alright, wait, whoops, wrong button. Stop holding. I want to see what happens if I cook three spicy peppers and two of a wild raspberry. Oh, okay. Not so much, but at least it can do help us. But okay. So at least we all know what the Rito uh, is all about. So we got that, and I believe that's gonna be, uh, you know, probably some other cast quest we can take care of. So, uh... Alrighty. Hello there. Who are you? So, good day. Did you need something? Who are you? I am... Jason of the Rito. The Rito? Yes. The Rito of Lake 
Toad Tory when the men are fine archers and the women better singers. You being a Hylian, I'm surprised you haven't heard that before. You should visit the village if you get a chance. Well, I will be happy to visit because I love to see what they look like and get to meet them. And just get to know them, that's all. And... Yes, the shrine is nearby. Two of us shrines we're gonna take care of. So, this is gonna be pretty cool. And I think we're gonna have a cutscene with the Divine Beast of Meadow. Like, it's flying, up, it's flying up high right now, which is just floating. So, we're, we'll just be um, heading up there, and uh, I'll be quiet during that. Okay, then, so, so that is a bit of a cutscene with the, you know, Val Meadow. Retail Village, here we are. Hello. Hmm, are you a traveler? I'd like to show you around, but now is not the time. Uh, where am I? This is Retail Village, but, well, you could say we're not in a welcoming mood. Talk to the folks in the village to hear all about it. Uh, what's going on? Alright, he's gonna show us. Did you see that beast in the sky? That's Divine Beast Vameto. It showed up a while back. The retail warriors who flew up to check it out were shot down. They say it used to be Divine Being that protected in the village, but it doesn't seem word divine to me. Thankfully, the thing I only shoots at anything flying up high up above the village. But still, it is pretty demoralizing for us Rito to have to fly so low to the ground uh I'm good thank you all right sorry if you hear the weird stuff in the background I don't know what's going on but anyways uh we got ourselves um uh, here we go um goddess statue so I'll get an another heart container I'll get to like 16 hearts So, yeah, I th I think I'm at 16 heart containers, right? Yes, I was right, 16 hearts. So I want to get to 30 heart containers as I can. So, uh, that's going to be a night time, which I'm not going to do it right now. So that's the food. And then, uh, yes, yeah, some armor shop. All right, I'm going to go ahead and sell stuff so I could grab some more, uh... You know, looking to sail. Alright, I'm gonna keep the woods with me. You know, I should be able to go down to Kilton's shop if I have a chance. So, yes, 1,000 rupees. I would take them. I'm glad I got so much stuff I can uh, bring it up. Because I can sell them whatever I want, so I can have more enough rupees for that armor I'm going to grab. Alright, 35. Nope, okay, it has 8. Um, you know what, I think I should keep Nightshade, uh, what is it called? I should keep the blue nightshade, probably for some side quest if I'm getting close mm -hmm. to like other maps. Oh. All right, nope, not that one. All right, you can sell it away. If you, like you can sell it, but I'm not gonna sell it. I want to keep it with. I want to keep it with me. Uh, for for the things are important to me. 
So yeah. Now I can grab a Rito's of suit. Since I already got for the Zora and the Goron, now I have time for the Rito. <laughs> And the cool thing about it, it helps, it'll keep us warm for many, like, uh, some kind of a, uh, really cold temperature. Oh, hey, was that? Okay, I could have sworn. <laughs> I could have sworn that something. Alright. Okay, I just see some of the kids, like, a child of the Rito birds. They are pretty adorable to me. Alrighty. Alright, let's do the shrine. Alright, I can go ahead and get... Alright, get rid of this red pin here. Alright. Nice. Okay, so let's do this. Alrighty, so wind, wind miles. Oh shoot, this is gonna be tough for me. Uh, okay, I haven't played this in a long time, so it feels new to me, guys. Just to let you know, if I haven't played a long time, so this game feels new to me. Oh, I don't have a... Darn, I don't have... Like, I don't have a Deku Leaf. For this, that sucks. All right, well, I'm gonna have to like cut this out and uh, you know figure out what to do with the puzzle. So I will see you guys when I figure out the puzzles. Oh, you know what? That's right. I figure it out. So, okay, so I just have to go. Like, yes, I got some arrows with me, which I can actually shoot it down. No wonder. How did I for? Well. Actually, keep the royal bow with me because I might need it. All right, I'll be sure to go to Kelton um, shop and during nighttime, probably at Tantano Village. All right, I'll go ahead open this. Sapphire. Alright, so I'll go ahead and drop this since it's badly damaged. I'll go ahead and take this one. I believe that's Feathered Spear. Alright. I'm gonna take a picture of that. Wait. Alright, come on. Oh my gosh. Really? How about okay, maybe the chest is in the way. Okay. There we go, that's more like it. Alrighty. Now we can go. Just want to get the good old picture looking for the spear. Alright, we'll hit this one. And we're gonna hit this one. Alright, we can hit that one. Hit that one again. Uh, yes. Hit this one again. Alright, so we just have to get those patterns like this. So we just gotta be sure we get those patterns right. Alright, now we're gonna have to, like, make it turn around by hitting those switches. So, like, hitting those fans. So that way I can make them. Here we go. It gets to the right path. All right. So there we go. Yes. All right. Got my glad I got my game guy to help to help me out because I know I because I knew I could get stuck and no no idea what I'm doing right now. But just happy I figured it out. I got my game guy to guide me around.
All right, there's so much stuff I'm gonna have to take care of, though. Alrighty. So, there, we'll get to the shrine soon, like, after we took care of something right now up here. I should probably, like, uh, scan Amoeba, but can't. Alright, hello. Ah, a visitor. Welcome to... Oh. Oh! That object on your hip. Could it be? Forgive me, where are my manners? I am Kainella, elder of Rito Village. Now then, is that not a Shiga slate dangling from your hip? That's right. Oh my, so it is true. That means you must be a champion like Master Ravali, one of the few able to board Divine Beast Valmetto. No, what am I thinking? The champions have all been dead for 100 years. This boy must be a mere descendant and a here terror of the Sheikah Slate. Ah, forgive me. Champion descendant, if you would listen to this old man's request, you would have my internal gratitude. A lesson? Thank you, truly. Now that I know you have the blood of the champion, there is something I must ask of you. How should I put this? I would like you to deal with Divine Beast Valmetto, the giant beast circling above us. Only a chosen one, a champion, can stop a divine beast. You must enter the beast and bend it your will. I tried explaining this to the more headstrong Rito warriors, but they wouldn't listen to reason. Tiba and Harth tried to confront Meadow, but it did not go out and Harth was injured. Tiba escaped unscathed, but I fear he now plans to face Meadow alone. As a descendant of the champions, perhaps you could help us. Please, find Tiba. If you work together, you may be able to stop Divine Beast Vameto. You got it. I won't let you down. So we're gonna go ahead and talk to her right here. So, Forgive my intrusion, but I overheard you speaking with the Elder. It sounds like you intend to help my husband Tiba in the fight against Meadow. But to tell the truth, there is not much I can do for you right now beyond telling you where my husband went. Where did he go? Well, my husband headed to a place called the Flight Range. It is, it's in Duronix Pass, at the base of the he Hebras Mountains. It's a place where Rito warriors prepare for our aerial combat. I imagine he's gone there to gather weapons for another run at Meadow. As it happened, he made his way to the flight range on foot this time. If you take off from Ravali's Landing, it's straight shot down to the flight range. Ravali's Landing is a memorial for the Rito champion, Ravali. So name in the hope that none might forget the events of that horrible day. Impressive, I know. Very few can achieve a mastery of the sky. Yet I have made an art of creating an updraft that allows me to soar. It's considered to be quite the masterpiece of aerial techniques, even among the Rito. With proper utilization of my superior skills, I see no reason why we couldn't easily dispense with Ganon. Now then, my ability to explore the firmament is certainly of note. But let's not, pardon me for being so blunt, let's not forget the fact that I am the most skilled archer of all the Rito. Yet despite these truths, it seems that I have been tapped to merely assist you. All because you happen to have that little darkness ceiling sword on your back. I mean, it's just asinine. Unless 
You think you can prove me wrong? Maybe we should just settle this one-on-one. -on -one. But where? Oh, I know. How about up there? Oh, you must pardon me. I forgot you have no way of making it up to that divine beast on your own. Good luck sealing the darkness! Descendant! Descendant, are you alright? My apologies. I fear I have said far too much. If there is anything you do not understand, please do not hesitate to ask. No, you're okay. Uh, we just got a memory about Rivali because cause we've been because I've been asleep 100 years ago and I forgot what Rivali looks like. But now I start to get understand what he looks like and how we end up like, you know, chatting each other. So now I know. So you're good. Don't worry. So um, anyways, um, so what I'm gonna do is we're gonna fly over there. So um, there is a shrine here, but you know, we're gonna go find um, Tiba because you know, because he's gonna face uh, Divine Beast Von Meadow alone, and we don't want him to do it alone. Cause, cause who's gonna help him if we don't do this together? Like, who's gonna help him to defeat Divine Beast Von Meadow without uh, help? Alrighty, so I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and eat some. Alright, I'm gonna find out as less, so... So, just bear with me that I'm gonna find which one is pretty much less. Alright, this one has three, so we'll just eat that. Not much, but okay, so... <laughs> Alright. We'll just enjoy getting snowed. It would be nice during winter. I can have fun playing in the snow. Oh! Wait! Oh, hello. Snow Fox Coat. Alrighty. I hope the wolf doesn't attack the fox. Because I would have feel bad, and I would have to fight it. Alright. There we go. I just like taking pictures of these, so I can add the collections of them. Alrighty. Hi guys! If you see me. Oh, there you go. Hi! Um... I'm just heading to the shrine and, uh, you know, meet some good friends. Uh, I hope you don't mind me just going, uh, cause I just love to take care of my own business stuff. You know, finding more shrines is my goal. If you, if you two know what I'm talking about. So, so, uh, I'm gonna do my own business to take care of, so, uh, I'll see you later. Alrighty, that was close one from that. Alright, Path of Hidden Winds. Alright, let's go ahead and fly up. Wait, whoops. Okay, don't. Okay, come on. Come on. Get to the wind. Okay, now I'm just gonna shoot you in the head. Alright, any rupees or... <laughs> I said rupees at the first time. Okay, I got purple rupees worth 50. So I did call it. Okay. Okay, hopefully I can get... Yes! Made it to the ladder. I was hoping I can, can get to the ladder. Oh, wait, that's too early. Okay, there we go. Now we'll just hop in here. Wait, whoa! What are you doing, Link? 
Link is trying to make things so weird, in my opinion. <laughs> no, no, no idea what he's up to about this. But already. So we got two spirit orbs. Okay. <laughs> Pretty cold, if you ask me, poor Link. But don't worry, I'm I'm sure we I am pretty much sure we can uh get to the flame. Like there has to be a fire where I can cook some. Now look at that. That must be him. So swallow bow. Alright, I'll take- oh no, I can't take- okay, maybe I won't take it in. <laughs> I don't know. But anyways, uh, let's go have a- we're gonna have a little cutscene here, so I'm gonna go ahead and be quiet on this part. Actually, pretty busy here. You should probably go. Okay. Uh, I'll leave. No. <laughs> well, are you sure? Did you need something? I'm busy here. I can help you. Help me. With with that with that exactly, uh, Valmetto. Let me get this straight. Some random hellion wants to help me bring down Divine Beast Valmetto. I'm not buying it. What's your name, stranger? I'm Link. Link, huh? Well, Link, I'm Tiba, but you already knew that. I'm guessing the Elder asked you to come here and talk some sense to me. Am I right? That's right. Just like the just like the other true trust any fool wandering to town. Look, you seem like an alright guy, but let's make one thing clear. I'm not going anywhere. As a retail warrior, I can't rest until my people are safe. There is only one way I'm going back to Retail Village, and that is once Divine Beast Valmedo falls from the sky. If I have to, to kill Meadow, so be it. Only then will I return to the village. Then let's get started. Are you serious? <laughs> well, far, far be it from me to talk you off the ledge. But it's as the Elder said, the only way to stop Divine Beast Valmetto is to get inside it. Fat chance of that happening. There is no way we can set foot in Meadow. Actually, so not only are you wingless, you're brainless too. Let me fill you in. The only people uh, able to enter Divine Beasts are the five champions of old. And unfortunately for us and the rest of Hyrule, they all died a hundred years ago. If it hadn't been for Ganon. Never mind. Let's focus on bringing down Meta, one step at a time. If we approach Meta recklessly, res recklessly, its cannons will blast us out of the sky before we get even close to that. So, I'm going to need you to test you before I take you with me. We Ritu Warriors use the updrafts and the revenge to hone our aerial archery skills. The updrafts are so strong here that a person could just open a cloth over their head and float up easily. Now, let's see what you're capable of. You have to maneuver through this air and destroy five of the targets. Set up in the valley in three minutes. I'm ready. Hmm. Then go destroy five targets with your arrows. Alrighty, so let's go. Wait, that's not my weapons. Or my bow. <laughs> I meant that. <laughs> okay, 
What am I doing? So five targets, he says. Just wants me to shoot the f five targets. Oh, you know what? Nah, forget that. Okay, wow, that was a failure. What the? Really? No. Wasted arrows? Okay, come on back. Alrighty, that's not so bad here. Did pretty well. You're a skilled archer. It was that if time stopped with every arrow you let fly. I've got to tell you, Link, when you first showed up, I thought someone was pulling a prank on me. But after seeing you handle that bow, I can tell you're the real deal. You must have seen a battle or two. Hundreds of them. Hmm. I believe it. Link, I feel I've heard this name be somewhere before. Well, if you really want to help me bring down metal, it's now or never. I'll get you to the possession so you can give its cannons all you've got. Hmm. Inside that treasure chest is a bow. I've modified it. Take it. And let me know when you're ready. Alrighty. So, I'll go ahead and uh, let's see the bow. I'll get rid of this one. And I'll just take a falcon bow. <laughs> Wish me luck for this part, sorry. <laughs> okay, it's time to face Divine Beast Va Meadow. Normal arrows won't put in a dent in those cannons. You'll need to hit them with f bomb arrows. There are my precious commodity, so don't expect me to do this again. But take these bomb arrows. So we got 20 bomb arrows. Also, it'll be cold up there. If you want to prepare a warm meal or bring some warm clothes, I'm ready. Hmm. All right. Well, let me ask you something. Why are you doing this? Why you risk your life to bring down Meadow? Um... Let's say, I'll say to save Retail Village. Mm -hmm. Retail Village? It's not like you'll get the keys to the village, you know. Well, that's nice. But no changing your mind once you get up there and see Meadow up close. That's fair enough. Right, get mm -hmm. on. All right, it's showtime. Man, even I feel like I'm going to freeze up here. There's Divine Beast Val Meadow. It has its berry up again. What a pain. What's wrong, Link? Too scared to talk? Let's get over the plan. You see those cannons? I'll draw their fire. While I'm doing that, use your bomb arrows to destroy the cannons. Got it so far? If you need to withdraw for a bit, just spray your clothes and float straight up in the updraft for a while. I'll take that as a sign that we need to re-regroup. Don't bother Amy for anything covered by Meadow's Berry. It's impenetrable. And whatever you do, don't get too close to touch it. And finally, I know I've said this a few times already, but don't forget your cold protection. We can move whenever you're ready. Let's go! Alright. Now go up, blow up those cannons. Alrighty. So let's do this. <laughs> I like how we just said, we, we could just switch clothes either way. Whoa, they almost shot me right here. Alright. So we're going to go ahead and shoot this. So this is what we're supposed to do. Like, we have to like, shoot uh, this um, right here. Oh gosh, hold on. Hold on, I need to like, uh, eat some, like, I better, like, I'm losing a minute from the, you know, the cold temperature. So I'm gonna have to get ready for that one. Okay, do I have... I, I guess I'll, I guess I'll do this one. I'll do another five minutes on this Alright, if you fall all the way down, then Rito will save you, grab you, and 
ask you if you're ready to do, um, you know, if you're ready to do this um, battle again. Okay, why can I not hit it? Okay, well, careful! I saw him just hit the, the berry. Alright, be careful, Tiba. Like, I saw Tiba hit that one, which that was pretty much bad. Alright, is it against? Okay, it did not see me. Okay, just one more. One more left, and now, and then we'll be, in, we'll be inside Divine Beast Vameta. So this is gonna be our chance. And you know, next episode we'll take on Divine Beast of Meadow for the third dungeon of the game. Alrighty. So wish me luck guys. It's gonna be cold for Link, but this is the way. So there we go, we did it. Divine Beast of Meadow update map objective. Well now, I've seen that face before. I had a feeling you would show up eventually, but making me wait a hundred years is a bit indulgent. You're here to wrest control of Meadow away from Ganon, correct? If so, then the first thing you'll want to do is find yourself a map. That guidance stone has the information for the layout of this divine beast. Can you make it there? Yes, I can make make it there. And I'm gonna and I'm gonna do it in the next episode. So I've been recording for myself in two hours and you know what's funny during a cutscene? I see um the blood mood, which I don't see blood mood right now. I, like I saw it. If you guys seen the video, you'll know what I'm talking about. It's like I saw the blood mood coming around, but but yeah. So anyways, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here. So thank you guys all so much for watching. If you all do enjoy this, make sure you drop a like on this video. Let's see how many likes we can get on this video. And if you're new to my channel, make sure you go hit a subscribe button. And let me know down in the comments below. And until next episode, we're gonna take on the third dungeon called Divine Beast of Meadow. And I will see you guys all in the next episode. Goodbye!